Hi, YouTube family. Auntie is here. It's Curls and Scoop. I'm Patty Jackson. I'm your auntie of pop culture. Let's start with a hug because you never know who's going to need a hug. We got Curls, Scoop, Light, our banner back here. We're in our new studios here at WDAS iHeart. Hope it is a great day. Let's start with SWV, Sisters with Voices, Coco, Lily, Taj. Lifetime is doing their life story. When you think of the late 80s and the 90s, these women ruled with just great songs. And this project has been in development since 2019. They've been through a lot. They disbanded. They got back together. And it has been great. If they're coming to a town near you, definitely go and see them. They appreciate the love and they still sound great. They literally are sisters with voices. I just have a great time with all of them. But when I first met Lily back in the day, I went to interview her and she was like, I'm the whole of the group. You know you don't know what to say when someone says something to you. You're like, ah. okay, okay. <laughs> I didn't even know what, I forgot the question I was going to ask her when she did that. But they're a lot of fun. But get ready for the Lifetime movie. We remember Andrew Wolfolk. He was an original member of Earth, Wind & Fire great saxophone player, 71 years old. He hasn't been with the group for a while because he has been battling illnesses, but he passed away at the beginning of the week. And we say, rest in peace, Andrew Wolfolk, one of the original members of Earth, Wind & Fire. The Johnny Depp Amber Heard trial. There is so much bizarreness. The other day, the judge was like, y'all better stop laughing in the courtroom. They're suing each other for millions on millions of dollars. Years ago, they used to be married. Child, whew. two toxic people can't be together. And the thing is, both of them have had to go under like psychological evaluations. And both of them, they're, they got issues. The both of them, he got issues. She got issues. There's a lot of lying. Johnny Depp is trying to salvage his reputation. I don't know who's going to win this. I, I don't know. Johnny Depp, he sits in court. He's funny. He's, he's, he's drawing. He's doodling. He's got a little notepad. He's got his little jelly beans. Then over here in this cup, he's got his coffee. He carries around a lucky $2 bill saying, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be victorious in this. It's issues. Amber Heard, you know, she sits there like really innocent, but they said she got issues too. She's hired security because she feels that Johnny Depp's fans are going to attack her. Whatever the judge's ruling is going to be very, very interesting. If you're a fan of Batman, there's going to be a Batman too. See, when a movie makes millions of dollars, there's going to be a sequel. Batman made with Robert Pattinson. He's returning $760 million. It's now streaming on HBO. 4.1 million viewers. There will be a Batman too. Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness. It's already, the movie don't open until next week. They do these advanced sales. It is already taken in. $42 million. Benedict Cumberbatch stars as <laughs> Doctor Strange. It opens in theaters May 6th. If you are a regular watcher of this, y'all know how much I love Kiki Palmer. And what do I love about Kiki Palmer? She keeps a gig, and she got another one. Yes, she's got another gig. Kiki Palmer is joining the judges of Legendary Season 3. It airs on HBO Max. It's all about the ballroom competition. She's actually replacing Megan Thee Stallion. They, don't, they didn't say why she left, but Kiki Palmer, she fits right in in the new season of Legendary. HBO Max ballroom competition starts streaming. On May 19th. Diddy said he's working on new music coming out with a new album. He is signed with Motown. He's going to be hosting and the executive producer of this year's Billboard Music Awards May 15th on NBC. Regina King 
think we're going to see a sighting of Regina King this Monday because if you're into fashion, it's fashion's biggest night. We're talking about the Met Gala. Regina King is hosting. It'll be the first time I think that we'll see her since the unfortunate death of her son, Blake Lively, her husband, Ryan Reynolds, Lynn manuel Miranda. It's going to be fashion's biggest night. Um, I think it's called In America, an Artistry of Fashion, but I can't read my own handwriting sometimes. So we just, I do know the first part is In America. It's a fabulous, if you love fashion, you'll get a kick out of it. Now this year, we don't have Zendaya. We don't have Rihanna, but I think we're going to see a new batch of just fabulous people and gowns and get up, even the kooky outfits. You know, a lot of people are like, that's not fashion, but even the kooky ones, like a Lady Gaga who steps outside of the lines, we're going to see it all on display, the Met Gala, which is taking place on Monday. People Magazine, they have... Um, release the names of their most beautiful. This issue comes out on Friday. Gracing the cover is Dame Helen Miram. She's 76 years old. Great, great gray hair. She doesn't call it beauty. She calls it swagger. And I totally get it because when you have that swagger and when you have that confidence, it is sexy. I say to women, because you get older, does it mean you stop taking care of yourself? Oftentimes, people want to, you get a certain age, people want to, you know, push you to the side or they just want you to go on the corner and be quiet. And no, we ain't doing none of that. Don't give up on your look. If there's something wrong, see what you can do. If it's your teeth and you got teeth missing, y'all know the teeth nut. Get them fixed. Get a little part-time job to get them teeth fixed in. Because if you don't fix your teeth, they it, they move and they shift. Your mouth shifts as you get older. No, being old, getting older, you know, it's not like, uh, you got to go through stuff. But you can keep your looks up. I don't want to hear, I don't wear makeup. You don't have to. But you should moisturize your skin. You should. You should moisturize your skin. Take care of yourself. Um, you losing your hair, you see me, I get treatments, I done went and found me some wigs. Do what you can do. Get away from toxic people. It's more than just the outside. Uh, your inside. Because a lot of people want to walk around unhappy and you should choose happiness. And if you don't like something, make a change, make it better, don't complain. Men. Burns me up. This is one of my pet peeves. You'll find a man who'll look like he's six months pregnant talking about, I don't want to be with no fat girl. Well, what are we going to do about you six months? You look like you're carrying a baby in that. Men, y'all got to take care of yourselves too. That goes for the teeth. Um, don't be afraid to go bald. My dad was bald. I know everybody ain't got the head to be bald, but I think there's such a liberation when a man can give up the hair when, when it's that time. Because you can look good with the bald head. There's nothing like a man with a bald head. Um, if you got to lose the weight or get yourself together, no one is asking you to be, to be skinny. But don't be unkept. Keep your look up. Because you get older, it doesn't mean that it ends. Helen Mirren, I'm so glad that they made this decision to put this woman on the cover of People Magazine because when you get older, you get better and you don't let nobody try to push you away or act like you don't matter or your opinions don't matter because they do. As you can see, I had a lot to say today. It's Curl Scoop, it's advice, it's my funny faces um, and all that stuff. Leave a comment. I'll be going through them comments. Give us a thumbs up if you like the video. Thanks so much for joining me. I'm Patty Jackson. I am your auntie of pop culture.